Hey guys, my name is Vishwas and welcome to a brand new tutorial series on Angular Material. In this introductory video, let's take a look at what is Angular Material, the prerequisites for this course and also the course structure. Alright, let's begin. What is Angular Material? Angular Material is a UI component library. What that means is Angular Material provides us with components to build awesome user interfaces in quick time. It is also an implementation of Google's material design specification. Just like how we have material UI for React, Beautify for Vue, we have Angular Material for Angular. The goal here is to learn how to use the library components to build clean and elegant UI. Now before we get started, let me quickly run you through the prerequisites. As always, HTML, CSS and JavaScript go without saying. In addition to these, you also need to have a knowledge of Angular. You don't have to be an expert by any means, but some basic knowledge is absolutely necessary. If you are feeling rusty, make sure to go through the Angular tutorials on my channel before starting this course. Now as of this recording, the current major version of Angular and Angular Material is 7. With new releases, there might be minor tweaks but what you will learn in this series will still hold good. So you can watch this entire series without any hesitation. Alright, how are we going to proceed with this course? First, we will learn how to add Angular Material to an Angular application. Then we will discuss about typography in Angular. After that, we will take a look at the different components that make up the library. The components fall under six major categories. We have buttons and indicators, navigation, layout, form controls, pop-ups and modals, and finally data tables. We will not take a detailed look at every single one of them, but we will cover the important ones. By the end of this course, you will have a good understanding of how the individual Angular material components work. You can then use that knowledge to build Angular applications that suit your requirement. Alright then, let's get started in the next video.